Hey everyone, Morgan here. Today we're going to talk about how to light a Bunsen burner, okay? Typically what we do is we take out a ring stand and we just use that as the base for the Bunsen burner. The Bunsen burner itself will be hooked up to a rubber hose. We'll connect that rubber hose to the gas line, okay? When the handle on the gas line forms a 90 degree angle with the pipe that it comes out of, it's turned off. When it is parallel like that, it is turned off. Okay, now it's an open flame. We have some concerns for safety here. So let's practice safe science or some safety glasses. Okay, now when you have the hose on, set the bottom of the Bunsen burner to be closed. This controls whether it's open or closed. When we're using it, it's gonna be halfway open, but it's easier to light it when it's all the way closed. But like that. Take your matches, or if you have a fancy striker or something along those lines, you can use that. Always light and position the match first. I like to say that it takes one Bravo student to light a Bunsen burner, where we light the match, we hold it over the Bunsen burner, and then with your other hand, turn on the gas. You can blow the match out, or you can have a little beaker of water here and just drop the match in that beaker of water. Now, once you have a flame, what you wanna do is adjust that air vent to be halfway. Now, as strange as this might seem, with a Bunsen burner, you can hear what a good flame is. If you listen carefully, you're hearing a nice burning sound right there. When I close it off and I deprive it of air, you lose that sound and it's just flopping around a lot. Halfway open, you get that good sound and what you can see inside the flame is a nice blue cone. And that is the hottest part of the flame. So if we're using this for something like flame tests, that's where you're gonna wanna put your sample, right there in the hottest part of the flame, okay? So again, one student to light a Bunsen burner. If you turn the gas on and get somebody else standing back here throwing matches from 10 feet away, you're gonna get a big fireball. That's not cool. So take your match, light it. Get it burning good. Close your vent. Hold that over the Bunsen burner and turn on the gas with your other hand. Blow that out, put that in there. And then when you're ready to start it up and you hear your good Bunsen burner flame. All right, so that's how you light a Bunsen burner. Thanks for tuning in. This is Morgan signing off.